there we go. What a lovely morning with the Merc girls, and I'm ready for this day in this glorious machine. So happy to be back driving a Mercedes Benz. Oh, make up on a big of a problem, I saw it. Seems we have a bit of a tire pressure issue. Even with the reduced tire pressure, this car is absolutely fine and keeping me safe on the road. I guess we're blind, I guess only the Mercedes. It's funny, it's so spot to pull over so that we can sort this out. Hi, hi, this is Nadia speaking. Um, I'm driving one of your wonderful vehicles and it seems I've lost some tire pressure along the way. I don't know what to do now at the moment. <laughs> ah, yes, yes. Nadia. Okay, so you say that the tire pressure lights on and you don't know what to do, eh? Yes, exactly. I've uh, parked in a safe space uh, and uh -huh. that's that's as much as I know. Okay, no problem. I'll be sending a breakdown technician to assist you shortly. Okay, how will you find me? Um, on the SOS system, if you load the breakdown, we can pick up your location on our system. Oh, oh, wonderful. So you know where I am? Yes. Okay, great. And um, how long will this take? Uh, it takes uh, roughly about 30 minutes. Okay, wonderful. Right. Thank you so much. I really appreciate Thank it. You. Thank Cheers. you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Yeah, bye. Hi. Hi, how are you Nadia? I'm so good. Thank you for helping me. My car is everything. It's my office. I take my kids to school and the fact that I have someone that can help me sort this out really makes my day so much easier. No, no problem. My name is Yudeshan. I'm the service technician and the breakdown assistance. Uh, tell me something, what went wrong with the vehicle? Well Yudeshan, pleased to meet you and I am not sure. I switched the car on and then just as I wanted to drive, mm -hmm. The light came on. As you can see here, it showed that there's loss of tire pressure. Yeah, I do see that the warning light is yes. on. Yes, so I can't take any chances. I've still got a way to drive okay. and I'm just a little bit nervous. So that's why I phoned you. Yes. Just to make sure everything is fine. Uh, so let me just touch basis of your vehicle. It okay. is equipped with a standard feature of the breakdown assistance, which is called the Mercedes Me. Oh, yes. So you can log it on your app, on your phone. Yes. Um, if not in the vehicle, you can touch this button here. You can just press it like that. Okay. And it will ring us automatically. Oh, wow. And then we know your location automatically. You don't have to give us your location or anything. We know exactly where you are. Okay. And when can I press this button? You can press it at any given time when you are in the emergency or when you have a breakdown. Okay, so if anything happens with the call, or if can I phone when I'm in a safety situation? Yes, so you have two options. You have the breakdown assistance and you've got your SOS function. This is for emergencies and accidents. Okay. They know your location as well and they'll automatically send emergency services to you. And is this included in the, the vehicle? Yes, it is in the vehicle. It's with built in some card and everything, so we know exactly your location and where you are. Oh, wow, okay. Well, you found me, so that's yes. great. Yes. And now we need to sort out this tire pressure. Okay, so your vehicle is equipped with a spare wheel. Um, as I can see from the spec of the vehicle. So in this situation, we have to change the wheel to put onto the spare wheel so you can continue with your journey. So the vehicle is equipped with the tools and everything that you need to do the tire change. Okay, yes. so is it something that I can do myself? Of course, it is something you can do yourself. Would you be able to show me first? I'm here to assess you. That's what Mercedes-Benz is here for. Okay, let's do it. 100%. <laughs> All right, Yudeshan, where do we start? All right, firstly, let me give you a smaller gift from compliments of Mercedes-Benz. Oh, thank you so much. It's a mask. So I'm gonna I'm gonna I'll hold back a bit and now it looks wonderful. Eh? It suits <laughs> you in the vehicle. So you can open the boot. Okay. This is the boot space. Underneath here is the spare wheel. So you can just press this down and lift it up. So you'll find that you've got a spare wheel here, and these are the bolts that go right. with the spare wheel, right? Okay. And here are your tools. Okay. Right? So here are gloves, so you don't have to get all spread <laughs> the ends of yours dirty. Fantastic. <laughs> right. Great. Okay. And now we're getting this out. Yeah, 
Okay, so this is a tire stop, oh, right? Stop. Okay. So it is very important when doing a tire change, reason being it will prevent a car from rolling. So in this case, and always remember this, if you are changing a tire, you need to place this in a diagonal spot. Okay, push it in as far as possible. Right. There you go. So if you look underneath the vehicle, let's go underneath the vehicle. I'm going to have to kneel down a bit. And then underneath there, there's a jacking point there, if you can see. So this part here, you're going to position it there so it goes into the jacking point. So this is the safest part of the vehicle. Okay. Okay, once you start feeling, yeah, once you start feeling it being tight, okay, you can leave it now. So lefty loosey, righty tighty. Okay. So you're going to loosen each one just a quarter way. All right. There you go. Okay, so you can see the vehicle is lifting now. So while you're doing that, it's always good just to monitor the movement of the vehicle. Okay. Right. If you feel that it's been a bit unstable, if you feel that the jack is moving, then stop. Okay. Okay. okay so it's above ground now. All right. So you can stop now, right? So this year you're going to use this and you're going to put it in here like that. So it's easier for you to turn the nuts out. Oh, wonderful. All right. Okay. So you can yep. go for it. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to bring the tire close and just assist you. So you're going to bring it close to where you want to put it, right? So you're going to look through here and then you're going to put that over the tool. Okay, All right? So these are the ball sets used for the spare wheel. So you're naturally, so you know you have to go in a crossover direction. Oh, am I natural? You're naturally today. <laughs> I don't think you needed my help. Eh? <laughs> Great okay. stuff. So what you're going to do is you're going to take... Now we need to make sure they're tight, right? Yeah. So what you're going to do first, you're going to take the wheel spanner, right? Okay. And then you're going to place it on there and just tighten it a bit, not too much. Why, why aren't we making it tight, tight? Uh, we don't have to. We just have to secure it and then we put uh, the tire down and then we tighten it correctly. Oh, I understand. All right. Okay. So um, just to explain to you why we cross over. Yes. So you can see it's on an axle. Yes. So if we start tightening from here going around the tire starts going oh, skew and you don't want that okay, yeah so, so yeah so it's evenly tighter onto the axle okay. the vehicle is now down at a safe level okay there we go so All that's right. done now we Perfect. can tighten it Firstly, let me be the first to say I'm quite impressed with the way you did this. I feel like I'm going to be out of a job soon. In, in my heels. In your heels, eh? I don't think anyone can pull <laughs> it off. Without breaking a nail. Wonderful, eh? you I did a perfect job. I wouldn't job. have been able to do with it without you. But you did speak about the different variants and I'd love to learn more about them if I ever drive a different type of car. Uh, you know what, Nada, let me do something better for you. The dealership's just around the corner. I can show you the different variants that we get with tires. Well, let's go. I can't wait to see. True to his word, Udeshin has brought a couple of vehicles to show me exactly what to do and how to exchange tires on all these different models. Udeshin, the floor is yours. Thank you, Nadia. Okay, as explained previously, there are different variants that we get on the tires. We can start with the C-Class. This is our W205 model. Okay, so that's the C-Classes. They come with MOE tires okay. or MO extended. It can be easily identified onto the tire itself. This year, if the tire has a puncture, it will seal itself, right? And if the vehicle is partially loaded, you can drive for a maximum of 80 kilometers. If it's fully loaded, a maximum of 30 kilometers. 30 kilometers per hour, or is that the uh, distance? distance okay, distance-wise. Right. Um, 
after that, that's when you get to the nearest dealership or okay. the tire center where they can replace the tire. Can you still contact the SOS 100%, button? 100%. If you don't feel safe driving the vehicle, they will arrange for a towing assistance where they can tow the vehicle to the dealer. Is there a speed limit on this tire? Uh, on preference, you rather keep it to 80 kilometers for 80 safety. Kilometers. Great. Then we've got the silver car. Yes. So now we've got the W177, which is our A-class. This vehicle here has a MO tire, right, which is a normal tire. It doesn't have an automatic seal. So with this in the boot, it has a compressor in it. Okay. Right? And in the compressor, there's another bottle that has a sealant in it. Oh, there we go. Yes, so you put it together, it's easily inspected on the compressor. What it does is it fills the tire from the inside, right? And then you can just pump it up with the compressor and it's a temporary use as well. Okay. You do not have a limit on the amount of kilometers that you can do with this vehicle. But it is recommended to change the tire as well. Okay, and would you suggest that you still find the technician just to make sure that you are proceeding in the correct manner? So normally what I would advise our clients, when in doubt or when you feel much safer, you, you are glad to contact our OE number and we're glad to assist you by coming to you or over the phone. Fantastic. Our white vehicle. So our white vehicle here, this is our GLB. So this has a spare wheel. So it's also an ML tire identifiable on the wall of the tire as well. So with that, once you experience a puncture, it will also give you a message on the cluster with a red indication. So that's when you can stop and do a tire for a change. So you can put a spare wheel on and then you can drive it temporarily at 80 kilometers an hour. Again, recommended to change the tire. Or I can phone you or and you can, you can come me. assist me. <laughs> do you think I still need assistance? I don't think you need any more assistance. I think I should refer our clients to you. Oh. <laughs> Thank you very much. Well, there we go. Mercedes is empowered, she is empowered, and I am definitely empowered. <laughs>